everybody so in this video I did a Walmart a, okay a back to school Walmart outfit style challenge under $60 Jesus that is basically what I did was it's back to school or I wanted to see if we could put together like a really cool stylish outfit using uh, all Walmart stuff like head to toe Walmart that's like a kind of a tongue twister a eh? Walmart so let's jump right I can't talk today, you guys. Oh my god. So let's jump right in, okay? Here we go, guys. I swear I always have to pee the second I walk in this place. Okay. Feeling this camel vibe? Like, is this a legitimate Toronto FC shirt? I'm not sure. Also, guys, I just got my waxing done. This was not properly timed, but my schedule is just jam-packed and I don't have time to do anything. Surprise, surprise. I think we're in the men's section. This isn't, like, terrible. I just hate how it, like, kind of looks, I don't know, like, cheaper camo, but what can we do? Mm. This is cool. Where did you come from and are you children's? Hello. So, so far everything I've picked up has been camo. You are cute. What on God's earth is fetin? Do you guys know what this is supposed to say? So we could go this direction as well. I love sweaters like these. My God, if I had children, 100%. Okay, 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 cute. Mmm, those are like a guaranteed blister, like 1,000%. Okay, these are like for real. These are actually like legit really nice shoes. Ah! Um, it is currently August. Don't know why we have this stuff out just yet. I guess it is Toronto at the end of the day. Look at it just staring me in the face. Stop staring at me. Stop staring at me. And then I got yelled at for filming inside of a Walmart. But you guys will be happy and proud of me that I did not succumb to the McDonald's and I did not get McDonald's. Although I'm starving, um, I can put something healthier in my body. That's what I did today and I managed to put together what I think is a pretty dope outfit. Um, yeah, and it came in all under $60. So it's definitely doable. You can definitely look super stylish and like very comfortable for going back to school. So the final outfit consists of four pieces. Um, they're very good like for school because you know the sweater can be taken off um tied around your waist if you absolutely have to um okay so this was actually the most expensive item coming in at 24.97 um and it's this really cool like knit sort of navy cardigan um or i'm uh, sorry not cardigan pullover um so what I really think is super cool and versatile about this piece is that not only is it so comfortable and stretchy and just like heaven, um, it has a hood. So that puts like so many more um, uses, that allows you to get so much more use, I should say, out of this item. So like I said, you could totally tie it around your waist and it won't look stupid because of the hood. What I loved about this sweater is that it is very cool street and relaxed and um, casual but it is a little bit of a step up and it's a cool mixture within the outfit because of the material okay so i got this sweater you guys in a size small that is what i normally let me just yeah in a size small um that's usually what i am in tops and sweaters but because i was layering it um so if i want something to be oversized obviously i'm going to get a bigger size but if i am going to be layering like i did with this outfit the key is is to get a small or or like kind of fitted um, like outer layer and then the under layer you want to be like really big and the color is beautiful really navy is like an all around oh, an all season color in my opinion but we paired that navy sweater with these super comfortable um, dope 
army pants, camo pants. Uh, so these are so comfortable, you guys. These are perfect for school, long days, especially if you're like commuting, sitting on transit, sitting in your car. These are so, so comfortable. Uh, they're just like a typical kind of sweatpant uh, with a tapered bottom. And what I absolutely loved about these, is, first of all, they're high-waisted. Um, I got them in a medium, so that's like my regular size. I'm usually always a medium in bottoms. Um, if you're like super tall, you might want to maybe just hold it up to you to make sure that they are going to be high-waisted enough for you. Um, they don't have to be high-waisted for this outfit that I did in particular, but if you want to keep them and use them, you know, for other outfits, it is just handy for them to be high-waisted. Coming in at $15, um, I liked, I liked even the white, the crisp white strings, that those are really nice. Uh, but these, like, this is a pretty decent print. This is like almost on par with like Aritzia and those types of stores. Those served as the bottoms for the outfit. So then bringing everything together, um, like I mentioned before t uh, to you guys, is this huge white t-shirt. So this is an extra large, and it's actually a men's extra large. Um, I really try to stay away, especially for like things that are like t-shirts and things that you wanna kinda to fit a little bit slouchier or boxier go for the men's section because I find in a lot of stores, unless it's like purposely supposed to be like that, a lot of women's stuff is too um, like contoured to your body. Like you'll see, you know, it kind of like shaped around like this, then it's like contour in the middle. It, it, it's like, it fits, it's flattering, it's more flattering, but that's not the look that we're going for. So I find men's stuff is just a straight box, not contoured whatsoever, um, and then you're really gonna get that like loose, like undone kind of whatever chill uh, style. I'm almost 5'6", so I'm like medium to like tallish. Uh, that's why I choose to get an XL. If you're a little bit shorter, maybe you just want to get a large. But keep in mind, especially from Walmart, this will 100% shrink. So this is, I'm honestly thinking, going to shrink a full size. Wear it more and more. Like, I've seen these shirts shrink a lot. So that's why I always start huge and then, you know, wash it and all that stuff. Uh, this shirt, you guys, came in at $5. If you get hot during the day, you can throw that sweater around your waist and then you have a white t-shirt on perfect. Um, or, you know, have it, like, sticking it underneath. You can even tuck this into your army pants, too. Um, with your sweater over top like it's just an unlimited useful piece of clothing and last but not least the shoes that I found at Walmart like the, they don't look like Walmart they do not I was so happy with them um, they say 1997 on them but they actually were on sale for $11 you guys can see that uh, so these were a huge steal with sort of um, like a sheen I can't I don't have my words today I don't have any words for you guys like, um, like very luxy sort of sheeny uh, fabric. This shoe was still super practical for uh, obviously going to school and like running around all day, walking your campus, doing whatever you gotta do. And then also too, I love this cute little platform because it's so subtle that like you would never feel it if you're walking around, uh, but it still makes it look a little bit, you know, just a little bit more fit. And $11, are you joking? Uh, so. That's the outfit, you guys. So comfortable, so, you know, casual, chic, smart, but also very, you know, trendy, I think. Um, I loved this outfit so much. Um, and the entire, the whole thing came in at around $55. I think it was like $55.91 or something like that. So that's a really amazing bang for your buck, and you have a whole outfit head to toe. I was thinking about doing some accessories as well with this outfit, but you know what? It just spoke for itself. I don't think it needed anything. Um, you know, if you have just regular jewelry, actually, I think I was wearing this ring. This is not from Walmart. This is just a ring that I wear often, like cut my, kind of my everyday jewelry. You could do something simple like that, but it really doesn't need anything. It has all the elements within the textures and the patterns and the sort of like how everything falls on your body. So I hope you guys love this video. And if you did, please subscribe to my channel. I would really much appreciate it. You can also follow me on Instagram at Heather Laduca and uh, happy back to school shopping.